Two U.S. Air Force B-1B strategic bombers from Anderson Air Force Base, Guam, flew near the North Korean border closer than they have in the history of the U.S. and Republic of Korea's ironclad alliance. It was a mission that reinforced the U.S. commitment to the security of allies and partners and also demonstrated capabilities available in the defense of the Republic of Korea. Immediately following the display of air power, one bomber landed at Osan Air Base and was greeted by 7th Air Force Commander Lieutenant General Thomas W. Bergeson. The general released this statement regarding the mission. What we are showing today is just one tool we have to choose from a wide array of options. The alliance grows stronger every day, and we remain prepared to defend and to preserve the security of the Korean Peninsula and the region. Lieutenant General Lee Wang Goon from the Republic of Korea's Air Force Operations Command made it clear that future North Korean provocations will not be tolerated by stating, should the enemy provoke us once again, the combined air forces will respond and eliminate their will and capability to fight. Officials from both the U.S. and Republic of Korea have stated that the North Korea nuclear tests are a threat to peace and security in the region, and that missions like this strategic display of air power demonstrate that the U.S. can operate from Osan and air bases in the region at a moment's notice. Air Force Staff Sergeant Darren Murphy, Osan Air Base, Korea.